Welcome to Missouri, 1894. Well, actually, it's Tower Bridge in London, on the Thames. But I can't afford the fare to take you all the way to Mississippi. Anyway, what need? Here we are on the most beautiful paddle, paddle boat. Just like the ones that used to ply the Missouri and the Mississippi 150 years ago in the heyday of paddle boats. I'm Geraldine McCorkran, and a few years ago, I wrote a novel called Stop the Train, a story of pioneers on the prairies and grasshopper pie and perseverance and train crashes. The characters I had, I met, created for that book, I became intensely fond of Sissy and Cookie, Miss Lucien, the ideal school teacher, the one everyone would like to have had and the Bright Lights Theatre Company who turned up when everything was looking really bleak. I always promised myself that I'd go back, pay them another visit. Hence, pull out all the stops. I would like you to get the idea that you need to have read to stop the train in order to enjoy pull out all the stops. This is a new book, new place, new adventures. This time, Cookie and Sissy and Tip Bowden are in Missouri. They've been evacuated there because of a bout of diphtheria back in Oakley. But they don't mind one bit, because the Bright Lights Theatre Company are holed up there in a derelict paddle boat, beached by the annual flooding. Unfortunately, they're not beached for very long before they find themselves hurtling down the river, keeping the, trying to keep their heads above water the best they can in, in every regard. But if they're going to earn a living, they'll have to do what they do best, which is to put on a show. But you can't make a showboat with a handful of actors. So the call goes out for talent, talent various. Preachers, singers, sideshows, performing dogs, barbers, acrobats. Someone who knows how to work the engines and steer the boat would be nice. Of course there are a few unwelcome arrivals. Gamblers, river pirates, sheriffs, creditors, mosquitoes. There are things in that river that make diphtheria look cosy. But to the strains of a calliope steam piano, they head off towards river races, funerals, hangings, babies, and the most important performance they will ever put on. I had such fun writing Pull Out All The Stops. They say you shouldn't go back. You shouldn't go back to a place that it will be not so much fun the second time around. But that's just not true. I had some amazing fun writing this book. Now, all that remains is for you to like it as well. I really hope you'll want to read. Pull out all the stops. I tell you what, I shall record an extract and put it on my website. So, if you go to geraldinemccorkram.co.uk and click on Listener's Corner, you'll be able to get your own sip of Mississippi. Pull out all the stops, all aboard. Thank you.